Hello everyone, I am Ahmed. Now I am going to introduce our lastest launch Toy DIY 3 in 1 3D printer. Here you can see it's Toy DIY 4 in 1 3D printer and the, the dimension is 460 into 400 by 460 mm and its total weight is 14 kg ok that's it so now I am going to unbox it so first I will take a knife to cut the strip so here you can see I am cutting the out tape ok cut from this side So at the top you can see there is a manual. Later you will see a black stereo foam. So we will remove the stereo foam one by one. Okay, first we will introduce the user manual. It's very informative and you can find a lot of details about these machines and common faults and you can see the equipment set and what you will got from this whole set. You can find this all of information in this manual. So now I will uh, introduce you to this machine. This is Toy DIY 4 in 1. So here you can see the whole body, it's metal structure, very durable and here you can see the monitor for controlling and in this side you will find the SD card slot and in front you will find the switch button and here is a beautiful logo you can see EQ maker. In the back side, you will find the wire for connecting with the tool head and at the back, you will find the slot for the filament tube, the one and two, the both you can use for the dual extruder and this is the plate, leveling plate, this is the, uh, in this plate you will place your object. In this machine you will find a very cool feature like you can see the heatable bedding you can see. Now I am going to open this box let's see what's inside. So I think this one is the tool head this one is CNC tool head this one is laser tool head This one is FDM tool head and at last we get the dual FDM tool head okay. and this one is the filament holder for holding the filaments and here we got a box tool kit and here we got the filament box. That's all we have from the toolbox. Okay, now I am going to open the FDM tool tool head as you can see. Here is the illustration for setting up. And this is the tool head. You can see this is the extruder. And as you can see, two filament tube port for dual color next I am going to open the FDM tool head as you can see the extruder and this is the single
Next, I am going to open the laser tool here. This one is the laser, as you can see, laser tool here. So, I am going to put it here. Next, I am going to open the last one, CNC tool here. As you can see, the CNC tool head will put a nozzle into it. Now I am going to open the filament holder box. As you can see, it's hidden here. So I am going to open it. This is quite heavy. This is the filament holder. I am going to put the filament inside it. Okay. Next, open the filament box. As you can see, filament written here. Here is our filament. We will put the filament like this. In this box, we can put two filament together. One and two. Okay. Now I am going to open this toolkit box as you can see. Uh, in this box we have SD card, SD reader, USB cable, sticker, spanners, power cable, safety glasses, CNC tool, CNC base plate, CNC fixtures and wood materials and PMM materials. Okay, let's open it. This one, this one is a filament tube as you can see, two filament tube for dual extruder, dual color printing. This one is the box for tools. This one is the power cable as you can see. This one is the very beautiful goggles for safety glass. This one is the clamping tools for CNC. This one is the nozzle scraper for dual color printing. This one is the power adapter. And this here is some sample for testing. This one is the plate, magnetic plate. If you somehow damaged it, then you can use this one also. Here is our CNC carving raft. We will do the CNC in this raft. This one is the nozzle scraper. Now I am going to put it on our 3D printer. So we will put it here beside. And here is a picture illustration you can find from here. As you can see this one is the nozzle scraper. This one is the three layer detachable plate. So we will put it here as you can see just like this. It's magnetic plate. Later we will see that CNC rafting. Okay. And we will use this clamp for clamping put into that hole. Thank you for watching our videos. If you want to know more about this toy DIY 4 in 1, you can contact us with our email, our websites, our phone number. You are always welcome. Thank you so much.